Hello my loves, it's Kasha Plannerista 101. Today we're going to be creating a spread in my catch-all planner, which is um, Moody Florals, and it is a classic size happy planner. This is for the week of April 8th through the 14th, and we are going to um, do a whole bunch of butterflies, you guys. So I'm going to be using the Spring Allure from the um, Live Love Posh, as well as a sheet of a printable stickers from planet darby um this is her cool tone butterflies look how cool those are like the coloring on those is gorgeous and i have these pink ones from here with the flowers and that's what we're gonna use so i'm gonna have fun combining those and then of course because these butterflies have a little bit of black in them on both light like warm and cold i'm gonna use black boxes so i'm gonna go ahead and start removing lines because these are clear so i want to make sure that nothing is showing through and while i do that if this is your first time joining my channel welcome i'm so glad you found me if you are coming back to spend more time with me thank you thank you so much i appreciate you so so much for being here okay so butterflies you guys i'm gonna start with placing these which are the pinks and then the blues and i'm gonna kind of go back and forth so bear with me as i do this oh my gosh look how beautiful like even though they're different paper they're both so intricate i kind of love how they work out together so I'm going to add some flowers throughout because flowers and butterflies go together hand in hand. So we're going to work on that. I'm going to add that one right there. It seems like that's a good spot. And I'm going to draw the checklists first. So I just use the circles um, lately. I think that clean look is something that I really enjoy. And I am using my Muji um 0.38 pen which is so thin and so sharp that i really really love it so here we go yep now on the other side i actually as i do this have a question for you guys do you carry your planner everywhere you go or is that kind of like a home staple and it stays on your desk and you only plan when you're home so my planner goes everywhere with me including vacations i know a lot of people don't take their planner on vacations but i like to write in what happened in real time i am not a good person to um like back plan because i like this is my brain <laughs> And that's why it travels with me at all times. So here we go. I'm going to go ahead and add all of these working um, boxes. So these are for my work schedule. And of course, the first thing I do is put a box all crooked. Yay me. <laughs> so talented, you guys, really. Okay, now let's go ahead and add all of these. So I'm working all five days this week. I'm going to be putting some extra hours, and that's okay, so I'll figure it out. There we go. That is awesome. And I need other boxes, like actual event boxes, not just work. So these are work boxes, and I'm going to have live boxes, and then we're going to decorate. So bear with me for a couple more minutes, or a couple more moments, I should say. Um, as I place these boxes all crooked and <laughs> we can start planning. And yes, I use different sizes. Usually on weekends, I have bigger events and smaller events throughout the week or smaller things throughout the week. So that's kind of what I'm doing. And now I'm going to go ahead and place all these decorative stickers. So if you guys have been watching me for a while, you know that first and foremost, my planner is fully functional and that's how I intend to keep it. 
I love the decorations, but the decorations are simply a small plus. Um, they're not the main event. So that's kind of where it is. Um, on the other hand, I am on a PR group for Planet Darby and her stickers are adorable. She draws all of these herself, you guys. So if you want to purchase them, you can use my code, which is Kasha15 for 15% 15 off. I am so, so excited to be able to share this with you guys because like I said, her stickers are gorgeous and they come in both tangible and printable. I use printables so I can print them myself. Um, this way I can have multiple copies, right? <sighs> if you guys know me, you probably have seen some of my Instagram stuff. And yes, I am a sticker collector for sure. So there's many sticker books that I have doubles of. I also use a very large amount of planners. Currently I'm on seven planners plus um, two bullet journals. One is for actual journaling and one is for lists. So yeah, I am a pretty big sticker user in all of these. So look at these butter, like these are so pretty you guys. And I was going to just use the pink ones originally, but um, I think mixing them up is going to give it like an extra fire because cool and warm together kind of look cool. So let's see how it looks. But yeah, they're beautiful. Um, let me know what you guys think. Are you a huge fan of butterflies? Because I am. Um, I get so excited when they fly by me. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's such a kid thing to do. But when I sit in my backyard and we back up to the forest, we actually have a lot of pollinators and butterflies are one of them. So when I see a lot of them, I get very, very excited. They're just such a beautiful little creatures, you know? So, yeah. So there's that. I'm going to go ahead and put this little guy here. Go, he's getting ready to eat the pollen off of that flower. Okay, there we go. Okay, and now I'm just gonna add a couple pink ones, maybe some flowers here and there, and I think that will be it. Let me know what you guys think about this spread. Let me know if you have those stickers and if you like them. Um, I'm just adding a few more butterflies throughout my spread, but I feel it's almost finished. I kind of don't like that flower on Tuesday. Let me cut this and put it there and then see if I can move that flower on Tuesday because that's bugging me too. So let's remove that. I don't know. Can I add another one? to the mix. I'm gonna move this and put like a bigger bouquet of wildflowers in here. What do you guys think? And that above. I think that looks slightly better. Because like, otherwise, why are these butterflies just flying around in the air? Okay, almost done. This is a very, very, very full spread. I did not expect it to come out this way. I think my vision was slightly different, but I still like it. I think it came out pretty good. Let me know um, if you like it. And as always, thank you so, so much for spending um, time with me. I'm very, very excited that you're here. I'm going to go ahead and pop this back into my planner and I'll see you guys for another plan with me very soon. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.